Hello and welcome to this video tutorial. My name is Paul Cairns and we'll, today we'll be uh, straightening photographs in Photoshop. This image, um, as you can see, is uh, with, well, it's, it's the sea and it's in northern France and uh, I, when I photographed it I was paying attention to the model and the horizon line in the background is not straight. It's easy to correct photographs like this in Photoshop. There's three different ways you can actually do this. Um, you can approach it from using the crop tool and we'll begin with that. So just press C on your keyboard or just click on the crop tool here. Drag your mouse across the image like this and release. Make sure you leave room around the crop box in order to uh, turn it and you do that by moving your mouse just outside of the box on the corner. As you can see it turns into arrows going in two different directions. Click on your mouse and then you can turn the box by dragging the mouse and until you get to an area that looks good to you. Release it Make sure that everything is, you know, looking good to you. You might want to change it a little bit. And then press the uh, check mark key. And there it is. Straighten image. Okay, uh, I'm going to go control Z, go back, and I'm going to do the other method, which is using the ruler tool, which is here, right underneath the uh, crop tool, inside the menu the rule tool is where the eyedropper tool is. So click on that and with this method you can um, just drag a line across the area that you want to straighten. So you just follow the horizon line like this or if it's a building and you want to do, uh, you can do it vertically as well. You don't have to do it horizontally depending on your image. And just release and above the image you can see that there's two buttons here, a clear button and a straighten button. If you're unhappy with the line you just press the clear and you can begin again and just drag it, release, and then press straighten and where is it? There it is, okay, that took a little while um, and now we have a straight image so control alt z to go back again and we're going to do the third method now which is a filter up here in filters and it's a method I use most often and uh, it's called lens correction, it's shift control r and a dialog box will pop up with the filter. Uh, normally the um, the straighten tool is pre-selected as you can see here, it's right here, it's already selected when you do this. Um, there is other tools here you can play with later on if you're interested in trying them, it's like the distort tool, uh, grid tool, hand tool, and the, uh, the zoom tool, but basically this is what you want is A, keyboard A, or just click on this icon here. The idea is the same as using the ruler you just drag across the image where you want and release. You don't have to drag across the whole image with this. You can just make a selection like this and it corrects it right away. Now as you can see I don't think this looks really good. It just went too far the other way. So it's easy to fix. The cancel button up here will cancel out completely uh, and go back to uh, Photoshop or press alt and then hold it and the reset button will come up and you just click reset and it will reset the image. Make sure that you select the uh, straighten tool and we'll just try that again and now that looks fine to me click OK and as you can see it does a really good job of straightening the image without having to use the crop tool thank you for watching the video tutorial I hope you found it interesting and useful um, if you enjoyed it please feel free to subscribe to this channel um, you can check out my blog at paulcarens.com forward slash blog. The name of the blog is Through the Photographer's Eye. There you'll find many, many, many tutorials um, in photography related subjects and uh, opinions and uh, different experiences I've had in the photography world. And uh, you can check that, if, check that out. And thank you for watching. Have a good day. Bye-bye.